Princess Catherine and Prince William made a special visit to Gatcombe Park Estate of Princess and, shortly after Buckingham Palace confirmation that the sister of King Charles has returned home to recuperate following a brief hospital stay. This visit came at a crucial moment as Princess and was in the early stages of her recovery following her recent discharge from the hospital just the previous day. Princess and, 73, left Southmead Hospital in Bristol on Friday morning after a five-night stay and has returned to her Gatcombe Park estate in Gloucestershire. She was admitted on Sunday evening after sustaining head injuries and concussion in an incident involving a horse on June 23. The princess suffered from temporary memory loss in relation to the incident, meaning that the specific details about what happened were not immediately ascertained. There were no apparent witnesses to the accident. Princess Royal, known for her dedication to public service and her active lifestyle, has always been a pillar of strength within the royal family. Her recent health scare, therefore, prompted an outpouring of support and well wishes from both her relatives and admirers worldwide. Princess Catherine, known for her compassion and empathetic nature, brought a sense of warmth and comfort to the visit. Her conversations were filled with genuine concern and empathy, offering words of encouragement and support. It was clear that her presence brought much needed solace to Princess Anne, who has been a pillar of strength and resilience within the royal family. Prince William, ever the dutiful nephew, mirrored his wife's sentiment. His interactions with Princess and were a blend of respect and affection, underscoring the deep familial ties that bind them. The visit by Princess Catherine and Prince William was not just a formal obligation but a testament to the close-knit bond shared by the royal family. It was a demonstration of solidarity and love, illustrating that even amidst their numerous duties and responsibilities, the royal family prioritizes personal connections and support for one another. Princess Anne's return to Gatcombe Park marks the beginning of her healing process. The Princess Royal is now continuing her recovery at home and receiving rehabilitation support. The sprawling estate in Gloucestershire has been Princess Anne's residence for many years and provides a private haven away from the public eye. Surrounded by nature and tranquility, it is an ideal setting for rest and recovery. The royal family, while always in the public eye, values their moments of privacy, especially during times of personal health challenges. The support from her family, especially from key figures like Princess Catherine and Prince William, highlights the unity and compassion that binds the royals. The palace has also reassured the public that Princess and is receiving the best possible care and attention during her recovery. Updates about her health have been closely monitored and communicated to alleviate any concerns. There is no date set for her return to public duty, which will occur when her medical team recommends it is safe to do so. Princess Anne's contributions to various charitable causes and her relentless work ethic have earned her immense respect and admiration. Following the incident, Princess Anne had to clear her work schedule for the week. She missed the state banquet at Buckingham Palace held in honor of the Japanese state visit to the UK on June 25 and was unable to fly to Canada for a planned visit. Her hospitalization and recovery mean the royal family's hardest working member is on the sidelines. Princess and is highly praised for her strong work ethic and often records the highest number of royal engagements in a calendar year. As she takes this time to recover, her absence will undoubtedly be felt, but her well-being is paramount. The royal family's collective focus remains on her full and speedy recovery.